Greetings from America, and a warm welcome back to Nostalgia Channel. In recent days, we've been met with somber news of the passing of extraordinary talents. Today's episode is dedicated to honoring their memory. Furthermore, we'll take a moment to reflect on the stars we've recently lost. Before we delve into this tribute, we kindly ask for your support. If this video or the legacies of these remarkable individuals have touched your life in any way, please consider showing your respect and remembrance by giving this video a thumbs up. Your gesture means a lot to us. Thank you. Britt Turner, the esteemed drummer and co-founder of the legendary Southern rock band Blackberry Smoke, has passed away at the age of 57 after a courageous battle with glioblastoma, a highly aggressive form of brain cancer, diagnosed in autumn 2022. Turner underwent surgery to remove a tumor in November of the same year, yet he remained undeterred, continuing to tour with Blackberry Smoke while facing his health challenges head-on. Since its inception in 2000, Blackberry Smoke has been a trailblazer in revitalizing Southern rock, skillfully blending country music elements with dynamic guitar riffs. With a discography spanning 10 albums, including chart toppers like Holding All the Roses in 2015 and Like an Arrow in 2016, the band has amassed a devoted fan base and garnered critical acclaim. In their tribute to Turner, Blackberry Smoke highlighted his exceptional character, portraying him as the embodiment of compassion, determination, and charisma. Turner's leadership and unwavering spirit have been instrumental in shaping the band's ethos, which will continue to guide them into the future. Britt Turner's passing is a profound loss not only for Blackberry Smoke, but also for the entire music industry. He leaves behind a legacy of musical brilliance and personal resilience, inspiring countless individuals with his unwavering passion for music and life. The overwhelming support shown to Turner and his family throughout his battle with cancer is a testament to the lasting impact he had on those around him. As plans are made to commemorate his life, the band and their fans mourn the loss of a true rock and roll icon whose legacy will endure through his music and enduring spirit. And in the tragic passing of Dennis Yoshio, a prominent bodybuilder and beloved figure in the fitness community from Brazil, has left a deep and sorrowful wound in the hearts of many. At the tender age of 32, his vibrant spirit was extinguished on the night of March 9th in a senseless act of violence outside his brother's home in Villa Matilda, Sao Paulo. The news of his untimely departure has sent shockwaves through the very core of the fitness world, casting a pall of grief and disbelief over all who knew him. Dennis Yoshio was more than just a fitness icon. He was a guiding light for countless aspiring bodybuilders and fitness enthusiasts worldwide. Through his infectious enthusiasm and unwavering commitment to his craft, he inspired others to pursue their dreams with relentless determination and resilience. His social media platforms served as a canvas where he painted the story of his journey, sharing the highs and lows, triumphs and setbacks, all in the pursuit of his ultimate goal, physical excellence. The circumstances surrounding Dennis's tragic end are both heartbreaking and infuriating. To think that a visit to his brother's home, a simple act born out of familial love, would lead to such a cruel and senseless fate is beyond comprehension. As he stood outside, unaware of the impending danger, he was ambushed by assailants who callously cut short his promising life with a hail of gunfire. In the aftermath of the shooting, amidst the chaos and confusion, Dennis's brother fought desperately to save him, racing against time to reach the nearest hospital. But fate had already dealt its cruel hand, and despite the valiant efforts of medical professionals, Dennis slipped away, leaving behind a trail of shattered dreams and inconsolable grief. His passing is not just a loss for his devastated family, 
who now navigate the painful void left by his absence, but also for the entire fitness community, which looked up to him as a beacon of hope and inspiration. His legacy, forged through sweat and sacrifice, will endure as a testament to his unwavering dedication to health and fitness, serving as a guiding light for generations to come. As we grapple with the senselessness of his death and the void he leaves behind, let us remember Dennis Yoshio, not for the tragic circumstances of his passing, but for the indelible mark he left on the world through his passion, his perseverance, and his unwavering belief in the power of the human spirit. Though he may be gone, his memory will live on in the hearts of all who were touched by his extraordinary journey. Eric Carmen, the celebrated American singer-songwriter, guitarist, and keyboardist, whose profound impact resonated throughout the rock band The Raspberries and his remarkable solo career, has departed at the age of 74. Carmen's indelible mark on the music world is immortalized by a treasure trove of timeless hits, including classics like All By Myself, Never Going To Fall In Love Again, and the iconic anthem Hungry Eyes, from the beloved film Dirty Dancing. Hailing from the heart of Cleveland, Ohio, Eric Carmen's musical odyssey commenced amidst the rich tapestry of his Russian Jewish heritage and the unwavering support of his family. Initially steeped in the world of classical music through programs such as the Dijak Rhythmics and tutelage from familial sources, Carmen's artistic compass was forever altered by the seismic arrival of the Beatles and the Rolling Stones. Throughout his formative years, he honed his craft in numerous bands, laying the groundwork for an illustrious professional journey. The zenith of Carmen's career arrived with the inception of the Raspberries in the late 1960s, where his prowess as a frontman and songwriter propelled the band to stardom with chart toppers like Go All The Way. Following the group's dissolution, Eric Carmen embarked on a solo voyage, seamlessly blending elements of rock, soft rock, and power ballads to craft a signature sound that captured the hearts of millions. His solo endeavors, often infused with classical motifs, bore testimony to his unparalleled ability to traverse diverse musical landscapes with finesse. Despite encountering hurdles along the way, including a temporary hiatus from the limelight, Carmen's unwavering dedication to his craft never faltered. The 1980s heralded a renaissance for his career, as he made notable contributions to major film soundtracks and engaged in fruitful collaborations with fellow artists. On a personal note, Eric Carmen's life journey encompassed three marriages and a return to his roots in Northeast Ohio during the 1990s leaving behind a profound musical legacy and a loving family, including two children from his union with Susan Brown. The announcement of his passing by his wife, Amy Murphy, marks the end of an era for legions of admirers who were stirred by his poignant lyrics and unforgettable melodies. Eric Carmen's enduring influence on the fabric of the music industry and his unparalleled ability to stir the souls of listeners worldwide ensure that his legacy will echo through the annals of time, resonating with generations to come. With heavy hearts, we bid farewell to Robin Bernard, a beloved actress whose portrayal of Terry Brock on the enduring ABC daytime drama General Hospital captured the hearts of millions. Her sudden departure has cast a shadow of grief over fans and colleagues alike, with her body discovered on a somber Tuesday in San Jacinto, California. As we await further details surrounding her passing, the void left by this talented performer's absence is palpable. Bernard's journey on General Hospital began in 1984, when she stepped into the role of Terry Brock, daughter to the malevolent D.L. Brock, portrayed by David Groh. Her character quickly became pivotal in the show's narratives, particularly during the gripping Laurelton murder mystery arc. In this spellbinding storyline, 
Terry found herself ensnared in a web of deception, grappling with the chilling aftermath of a murder she believed she had committed, only to unravel a more sinister conspiracy with each subsequent death. Throughout this riveting drama, Bernard's performance soared to new heights, especially during the heart-pounding chase across Catalina Island, a scene filmed on location that showcased her remarkable acting prowess and cemented her status as a fan favorite. Before her iconic role on General Hospital, Bernard had already begun to leave her mark on the entertainment industry with memorable guest appearances on primetime television series like Simon and Simon and the Facts of Life. Her versatility and magnetic presence made her a sought-after actress for both daytime and primetime projects. Although Bernard bid farewell to General Hospital in 1990, her legacy as Terry Brock lives on, etched into the hearts of fans and colleagues who fondly reminisce about her impactful portrayal. As the entertainment community and her admirers grapple with the news of her passing, they unite in celebrating the extraordinary talent and indelible mark she left on the world of television drama. The outpouring of tributes and condolences in the wake of Robin Bernard's passing is a testament to the profound impact she had on those around her. As we honor her memory and await further details surrounding her untimely departure, we find solace in the enduring legacy she leaves behind, a legacy of unforgettable moments on screen that will continue to resonate with General Hospital fans and beyond. Paul Alexander, affectionately known as the Man in the Iron Lung, peacefully departed this world on March 11th at the age of 78. His journey, marred by the cruel grip of polio at the tender age of six during the Dallas outbreak of 1952, saw him confined to the confines of an iron lung for the majority of his life. Despite this physical imprisonment, Alexander's spirit remained indomitable, radiating hope and inspiration to countless souls worldwide. Throughout his extraordinary life, Alexander transcended the limitations imposed by his condition, achieving remarkable feats that defied all odds. With sheer determination, he mastered skills like writing, typing, and painting, using only his mouth and a stick, an ingenious testament to his unyielding resolve to conquer every obstacle in his path. His academic prowess was equally astounding, as he earned degrees in economics from Southern Methodist University and law from the University of Texas, triumphantly passing the bar exam. Beyond his academic achievements, Alexander dedicated himself to advocacy, championing the cause of polio research and penning numerous works that illuminated his multifaceted talents and unwavering commitment to societal betterment. In March 2024, his extraordinary resilience was immortalized in history when Guinness World Records officially recognized him as the longest living iron lung patient, a monumental tribute to his enduring strength and courage. Yet Alexander's story is not one of solitary triumph, but of the boundless support he received from his community, family, friends, and caregivers who stood by his side, offering unwavering love and encouragement. Through the power of social media, he touched the hearts of thousands, spreading messages of hope, perseverance, and the profound importance of cherishing life's simplest joys. As we pay tribute to the memory of Paul Alexander, we celebrate a man whose life was a testament to the resilience of the human spirit, a beacon of courage, love, and unwavering determination. Through the poignant reflections of his brother Philip, we are reminded of the profound impact Alexander had on all those fortunate enough to know him, leaving behind a legacy of strength, compassion, and solidarity. His life serves as an enduring reminder of the remarkable capacity of the human soul to overcome adversity and the transformative power of love and empathy in navigating life's most daunting challenges. And here we temporarily conclude the journey of reminiscing about the recently departed famous individuals. 
If their images have touched your heart and earned your admiration, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel to help us stay motivated in producing the program. Thank you sincerely.